when I come to Tamils across Sutton and Cheen, London, the UK, and indeed across the world, can I wish you all a happy Thai Pongal. Tamils make such a positive contribution to communities across the UK in all aspects of life. Indeed, in December last year, I was delighted to see the London Assembly unanimously pass a motion to declare the month of January as Tamil Heritage Month. And that's very much in the spirit of recognising the vital role that the Tamil community plays in the cultural, economic and social life of London. Now, Pongal is one of the oldest festivals and it's celebrated by Tamils across the world. Here in the UK, traditionally, we have Thanksgiving in September as autumn approaches and our New Year on the 1st of January. Pongal combines both of these. It's both a Thanksgiving festival where during the celebrations, Tamils give thanks for the bountiful harvest. And with the Pongal being celebrated on the first day of the first month of the Tamil calendar, it also heralds in new beginnings. It's said that with the advent of the month of Thai, January, comes new opportunities. And we look forward to those much needed opportunities, whether that's to get vaccinated, to get boosted, to return to a sense of normality, certainly, as we learn to live with COVID and build back better. Now, Pongal is also an occasion for family reunions and the chance to get together, something we missed for many months over the last couple of years. Now, over the next few days, in, as we celebrate between the 14th and 17th in Ealing, SOAS University in Westminster, I'm looking forward to joining many of you, my Tamil friends, to cook delicious pongal, that dish of the sweet concoction of rice, mung dal, jaggery and milk, and also try the usual array of treats that we, that we share together. But finally, we should also remember those two really important central themes of pongal, love and peace as we start the Tamil New Year and resolve to come together in our communities and help each other through the darkness of winter towards the light of spring. Nandri.